الرحمن الرحيم في البداية حقيقة نحن نؤكد كوزارة الصحة بأهمية وجود مثل هذه المؤتمرات العالمية التي تستقطب ليس فقط الحضور من قرابة 22 دولة على مستوى العالم وإنما استقطاب أكبر الخبراء والعلماء في مجال أمراض أنف الأذن والحنجرة وكذلك تقديم التقنيات المتطورة عالية التقنية التي قدمتها حوالي 22 شركة من الشركات العالمية العاملة في دولتنا الحبيبة فهذه هذا المؤتمر لا شك بأن له دور كبير في رفع مستوى الأداء للأطباء والمتخصصين المعنيين بالتخصص الإن تي أو الأنف والأذن والحنجرة حيث أن مدينة دبي تستقطب هذا المؤتمر العالمي لأول مرة على مستوى الشرق الأوسط وحقيقة هنالك قرابة 200 متخصص من المتخصصين في هذا التخصص شاركوا في اليوم الأول من المتوقع وصول العدد إلى 400 شخص This event is actually is all about otology, uh, otology and neurotology, and we've we've been lacking this kind of subspeciality meetings in the region. And uh, as you know, in the Europe and the U.S., people are moving away from general meetings. They they want more focused, more specialized meeting. And uh, this meeting aims to give the people and the doctors who are specialized mainly in otology. Uh, to come to a focus and uh, to get more training and get exposure to the recent advances in this field. Uh, the discussion mainly will be around uh, the uh, surgical procedures in otology, neurotology and skull-based surgery. Uh, we were expecting uh, about uh, two, 200 doctors to attend and we have over exceeded that and I think uh, the recent numbers I have is over 350, 400. So uh, the demand is there. The companies, uh, the sponsors, they want to come and uh, basically present their products, especially in this field, and the doctors are interested to attend. So I think uh, there is a market and there is a demand for this uh, type of um, event. Uh, and uh, I'm happy that we did it, and uh, inshallah, we will continue. Uh, next year and uh, we'll try to do better. It's been wonderful. I, I have to give my congratulations obviously to the committee chairman and people he's appointed to help him out. I think it's a wonderful event that has been arranged. And it was really ambitious because it had uh, not just the main conference with the plenary sessions, but they had breakout meetings as well too. They'll cover audio vestibular medicine, management of dizziness, and on top of that they have uh, surgical courses in temporal bone dissection uh, as well as a functional endoscopic science surgery course. So this is a very comprehensive course and would certainly uh, well suit any laryngologist who wished to you know enhance their skills and their knowledge. Well the main highlight for me is getting together with many of my former fellows and to see how well they've done over the years and uh, in some ways it, you know when one is envious of what they've been able to accomplish but, but getting together has been a wonderful experience uh, because we can share ideas, uh, certainly share research uh, protocols and future and I think it's just great for the communication within the field because sometimes we don't do enough of it really. Well, Dubai is always a wonder to me. Um, it, it really is, it, to me, and I, I may use the expression wrong, but it really is an adult Disneyland. They, it, it, what, we, what has been built out of, uh, if you like, the desert and a small emirate has now grown into a major metropolitan, cosmopolitan city with so many amenities, and it, it's a wonderful place to hold meetings because really it is at the crossroads of Asia and the Pacific, if you like, and it, it, it's such a wonderful spot, and the people are warm, and we've had nothing but positive good feels about being here. 
Uh, I've been so uh, impressed with the professionalism of Index itself and we are so thankful that they were responsible to a large degree for organizing everything because it's a Herculean task to try and do this all your own, having run many meetings myself and you know spent many hours you know in the dark trying to organize things to get speakers to look after funding and this and that. It's nice to have a professional organization that knows what they're doing. I've been so impressed with the hospitality and that you know we've been looked after from the minute we arrived and the level of science at the conference is excellent um, and the interactions that I've been having with colleagues has been nothing but amazing so I, um, I've been nothing but impressed um, by what I've experienced. I, I can't believe how well organized it is. It's been amazing because everyone comes from such different backgrounds and different experiences, different training, have different patient populations, and we. There, but there's similar threads that run through all of our practices, and so it's really a, a dialogue, and we're really sharing lots of information and experience. I look forward to coming back. I find this is a very good start and a very good beginning because this is maybe the first or the second autology specified meeting in the region and now ear surgery is starting to become a separate branch when we come to ear, nose and throat and we have these highly specialized congresses about ear surgery because we have different types of uh, conditions that we treat in the ear from infections to tumors and also to the newly invented, or let's not say so new, maybe 20 to 30 years, which is cochlear implantation, which is the retrieval of the hearing sense to the, uh, to, to the patient. These are maybe the most important thing in the modern era when it comes to conferences, because it's the way by which we exchange experiences, and also congresses are not only to uh, show our results, but they're also to teach the junior generations uh, how to do surgery and how to diagnose patients and how to assess their result. I think this conference is going to progress more and more. It's going to develop more and more. We're going to have more workshops and more instructional courses. Actually, it is an uh, excited and uh, excellent conference. It's a comprehensive, a lot of topics which is related to the uh, subject of otology. I think in my knowledge is uh, this is the first time to happen uh, to be very focused and uh, sub-specialized because as you we know as ENT is the three branches which is uh, otology, ear and uh, rhinology which is nose and head and neck. So it's a challenge I think for the organizer here to uh, go ahead with the uh, uh, high risk, especially in attendance and participate. In principle, it's part of our commitment for a continuous education. And we've been frequently in UAE doing multiple workshops. Um, we have other two great events. This is a very good start. Uh, key speakers, good audience, um, key players from the industry are available. So I think it will be it will go, grow more popular in the coming few years for the quality, for the material, for the speakers, for the program. It's good and it will contribute greatly to our mission in educating the people and developing the area and the whole Middle East, not only in Dubai. It's a first year, but for a first year, it's great and it will. It will boom. The topics are great and the program is very good. The big companies are all here and that's like a very good sign. The conference itself is uh, a great thing. We're very happy that uh, our autology conference has come to Dubai. Um, we've seen here a lot of familiar faces. It's great uh, to be able to exchange with uh, all the uh, international and uh, the local doctors at this conference. Conference venue is, is wonderful. We're here in a wonderful new hotel and uh, the conference venue and the organization is really really perfect so um, we are very very happy and proud to be here also be invited and uh, allowed to participate in this very special uh, event and uh, we are looking very much forward to see this event uh, growing further in the future and to attract more and more people from the Middle East and all over the world.
first time to participate. Uh, we found a lot of KOLs here, key opinion leaders. The uh, exhibition is, uh, I think it's a success story because uh, we had uh, more than a company participating here, showing the latest technology with a lot of uh, scientific lectures about the latest and uh, it is, I think, uh, successful event that will take place every year. For the first time, it's uh, we participating in this uh, conference, and we find that we are in good relation with with many of the doctors that are attending, and they are very happy with the subjects they are getting. They said that the subjects that they are the of the conference are very. Uh, scientifically to them. As a company, we, we, we get many delegates are visiting, uh, visiting our booth and they are happy to, to know there's a, a hearing aid company in this exhibition like Widex and they are uh, also we have the equipment of uh, Automatrix. They get more information about us and our location and we get more information about them and if they change hospitals or something like that we get this information. We was just thinking about this um, when we just want to know when it will be and then we will uh, participate of course because it's uh, give us a, a, a good image as a company with, with the doctors. It was better than our expectation uh, Dubai Autology in the first day we see the uh, uh, Minister of Health he was here so it was very impression to us and we are the hospitality and everything it was okay correct person, the correct doctors, they were here. So we were happy about that. Well, to tell you the truth, Dubai Autology is the first, uh, first of its kind in the region. So it's specialized in the autology. Uh, I think as a first year, it's, it's a good start. We hope maybe for the next year and the coming years that it's going to be better. Uh, all in all, specialization is always important, specialization is always good, so I'm sure there's a new topics they are discussing inside, and uh, I hope it's successful for the doctors. Mm -hmm.